morning and thank you for joining our daily outlook and today we'll cover the changes in gold. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The gold gained 0.3% against the dollar in the last session. According to the Williams indicator, we are in an overbought market. The euro-dollar pair corrected downwards in the last session, falling 0.1%. According to the stochastic RSI, we are in an oversold market. The last session saw the pound drop 0.7% against the dollar. The CCI indicates an oversold market. The Bitcoin-dollar pair dropped 2.5% in the last session after rising as much as 2.9% during the session. The stochastic RSI indicates an oversold market. Thank you for your insightful trading ideas. Moving on to world headlines. European stocks fell to their lowest in a year, with the DAX and Euro Stocks 50 indexes closing in a bear market as soaring oil prices spurred concerns that high inflation will hurt economic growth. Cryptocurrency trading platform Coinbase Global Inc. said it blocked over 25,000 wallet addresses related to Russian individuals or entities that it believes to be engaging in illicit activity. Samsung Electronics Company has suffered a cybersecurity breach that exposed internal company data, including source code for the operation of its Galaxy smartphones. Thank you. Now let's hear today's most important economic event. The U.S. Red Book Index will be released at 1355 GMT. The Eurozone's gross domestic product at 1000 GMT. Finland's trade balance at 0700 GMT. Japan's gross domestic product will be released at 2350 GMT. Japan's gross domestic product annualized at 2350 GMT. The UK's BRC like-for-like -like retail sales at 0 hundred hours and one minute GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log in tomorrow morning with the latest news and events from the financial markets.